Hello everyone, I'm back with another video and in today's video we're going to be up against uh, Gap Mixon and uh, KZT and I'm going to be with Error 404. Now of course before we start make sure to subscribe, smash the like button and ring the bell icon to be notified of any contents coming from my channel. Alright so without further ado let's go jump straight into it. Alright, so we see the battle around here, and I'm going to be the yellow player, error 404 will be the red player. So, let's go. Fast forward. So, we go ahead and gather those containers. And, um, I'm not going to be opting out for any navy or anything of the sort. Okay, level 3 HQ. Wasp is around here. Uh, super container. We see the battle right here with the uh, error 404 against gap mixin right there and then that server is jumped in <clears throat> wow just, just, <laughs> just look at this man he almost got that super container i mean error 404 almost got that super container but thanks to the servers yeah it's not gonna happen anytime soon so one able platform around here to safeguard against any uh early aggression of deltas or anything of the sort gun towers around here this is to prevent any attacks uh rush delta attacks and ooh, okay so you see those uh assaults okay good scout here by my partner great job here okay we fast forward again okay oh as i suspected delta and cerberus so in retaliation to that i have like gun tower right here to of course safeguard against this okay so we see him moving around around here and uh yep level two vehicle factory so he's going to have to prepare for that x facility level two for that seraphim okay that one delta saw my <laughs> rifleman poor rifleman okay so dragon flies around here and then of course a jaguar in production I did uh, use my uh, riflemen around here to act as a wall so the deltas will move over to this location around here since the barracks, you know, the, the barracks is blocking or obstructing the pathfinding for the gun tower so they'll have to get closer or they cannot really get in between them effectively. Meanwhile, I'm saving for an HQ level 4 and here goes the deltas. Okay. Gold defense boost. And then, of course, Narrow Passage, thanks to my Riflemans acting as a wall. Okay, there you go. Obliterating those Deltas along with the Acid Strike. And then that server has already made this jump. So at this point, it is a very, very successful defense here from my end. Well done, Rifleman. Well done, Rifleman wall in boy. Okay, so we go over here as Scout. Ooh, Vikings around there from Cap Mixon. And then... X facility level 2, still HQ level 3, they saw that I have HQ level 4 around here. So, yeah, this can be really, really tricky. Seraphim just popped out there, and the uh, passive ability of the <laughs> Seraphim has been activated thanks to that one rifleman that throwed, you know, that threw the grenade at that <laughs> X facility. Okay, meanwhile, I'm going at research facility um, level 2 for that Leviathan. Okay, and uh, let's see how my partner is doing. Basically the same thing, except the mole. He has the mole around there going on for him. And here goes the Seraphim um, on hide mode. I don't know, man. I don't know. And I got like plenty of things around here. And uh, yep, yep, yep. Okay, we fast forward a bit. We see uh, Error 404 getting into a formation to defend against that Seraphima. Uh, Serafima getting rid of that naval platform with the active skill and then he's going to have to fly away. In the meantime, I'm going to have to try and assist him by sending my dragonflies and wasp around here to at least help out zone that Serafima. Oh, we got like two vikings attacking from the shore. That's why that Serafima actually got rid of that annoying torpedo platform. Now keep in mind that I'm lagging around here just now. I recovered from the lag and I used a boost. Okay. Acid strike or acid burst. Okay, I'm gonna to have to throw another acid burst around here. And uh yeah, I mean I canceled the order because they just, you know, they moved apart from each other. 
And so I'm gonna have to try and target that Seraphim once again. Okay, and uh, well, this is basically a successful defense here from Era 404, with the exception of losing that Porcupine. Okay, now, and Kablooey. Okay, successful defense. I lost two uh, Dragonflies. Meanwhile, on my end, going level 3 research facility as well as that um, special vehicle factory, going level 2, and on to the Mammoths, shall we go. And so I'm going to have to march forward here and try to obtain this super container. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to have to leave that assault alone. Wait for the right opportunity. Yeah, joke's on you, my man. <laughs> okay. Alright, we see a battle right here with the uh, Aero 404 with the Mole. Two Porcupines, Cerberus, and this vastly outnumbered, obviously. And, uh, you know, I mean, Porcupine's damage to level 3 armor is trash. So, you need at least, like, 6 Porcupines to be at least be able to deal some huge chunk of damage instantly out of that Seraphim. Ooh, oh my god, oh no! Okay, that that Wasp fell, and then that Cerberus made a jump before he actually been destroyed. Okay, Super Container appearing around here, and uh, yep, Leviathan is already out from Error 404. Uh, we go see what he has to offer here. Okay, Scout, I'm gonna have to try and take this position around here. And uh, Scout here by KZT. Okay, Cap Mixon's uh, you know, doing very great here. However, he actually got that Super Container at the expense of that Viking, which isn't really nice-ish. Oh, see Antler or KZT making an appearance right there, so I'm gonna have to retreat as I don't have any chameleon just now popping out, so it's a bad idea for me to engage. And then, Error 404 having a huge engagement around here, Cat Mixon bulldozing his way in from above, from below that cliff. Normally, that's not suggested as a confed or as a resistance or whichever faction that is. It's not an ide a good idea for you to. You know attack but since he is get fed with the shield he can just do that and th that's basically bad micro again with the shield in front of the Zeus um yeah okay and uh, the lack of typhoons here are very 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 evident here as the uh, cat makes in the uh, cat makes in will go ahead and retreat and then lose some Zeus along the way as they try to uh, escape as we all know the Zeus are too slow Okay, so he'll lose uh, that Zeus around there, and oh, oh, come on, come on, escape, 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 the skill, the skill. Okay, I was, oh my god, man, that that got me nervous. <laughs> oh no, don't overextend, don't overextend that Leviathan is so close. Oh no, okay, all right, so we see right here, and I am in very good formation against this attack coming from KZT, and just look at his army right there. Streaming across the map towards my base. Meanwhile, um, Error 404 here is still dominating uh, Cat Mixon. However, with just one Solaris, prevented this whole army from attacking him. The impact of that hero is insane. And there goes this hero beam. And oh no, you're so gonna have to retreat, man. You're so supposed to retreat right now. Oh my. Oh! Ooh! Oh! What was that? All of it. Almost killed that mole. And so one porcupine and so on. All of a sudden, the ta tables have turned into the favor of Cat Mixon. Meanwhile, I'm going to have to try and scout around here. Since this guy is above a cliff. And I'm waiting for him to go down. But he's not going to. Uh, he's not doing so. So I would rather get into a formation to fight him. Here goes Serafima, Solaris, just the heroes here against <laughs> an army, heroes versus army. Here we go. Okay, ZT has had enough of the waiting game and he's gonna go forward and come towards me. And here we go, man. Okay. Acid, uh, no, Seraphim active ability being thrown in. Okay. Acid strike along with the Nuviathan nuke to follow up. Okay, my wasp has been destroyed. Boom! Well, we all know the damage. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to have to retreat right here. Retreat, fall back for a bit as that Cerberus might actually jump. 
and I don't want myself to overextend but yes I did lag at this point and I was not able to control my porcupines thanks to the lag so my army just went here and waltz in to attack the, the KZT's army yeah man very bad very bad very bad okay shields been destroyed that Serapima is close by the way I still have class 7 Leviathan here mind you okay Serapima has been destroyed and oh no my Leviathan is so oh and then the Serapima from the blue cap mix in let's see now I'm gonna have to try and make uh, the most out of my stuff here by destroying that Solaris and then I'm gonna have to call it quits as he barely has any Zeus here I'm gonna have to retreat. I got like three porcupines chasing after him, uh, chasing or firing at that Serafima. Now, common defense we has been used to somewhat defend against that attack as much as I can. And, uh, yep, I still have some leftover Jaguars around here. Got like six Jaguars, one Mammoth, two porcupines, and the rest is history since there's no shield around here, bad micro, things like that, and of that nature. And so I'm gonna have to save resources again for that uh, Leviathan, uh, which is now in production. Wasp uh, already appeared. Okay, I'm gonna have to chase again after those army that are trying to retreat desperately around here. Okay, now, and we see here again, um, Cat Mixon with the Solaris without a shield. Okay, very bad micro around there. Very bad micro, very bad, very bad. Come on, come on, come on, destroy it, destroy it. Uh, of course, it's gonna retreat under the cover of the shield. Now I'm going to have to obtain this super container, which will give me the advantage once again. Okay, now again here is my base. I got like three special vehicle factory for that a uh, porcupine, chameleon, mammoth, and jaguar, dragonfly, whatever shenanigans that I got going for me. Meanwhile, Aero 404 is here, just stuck inside his base, reproducing his army with two vehicle factory, two special vehicle factory, and that's all he basically have. You also have like what six supply centers here and oh that's a bad idea oh, the wasp has been destroyed almost instantly by those uh, by those typhoons oh solid hit right there although did not really graze or that was not the ideal location for a target server is uh, making an appearance of a jump leviathan boom that was actually a solid hit right there however it's not really enough to destroy rank 29 units <laughs> as it is very 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 tanky okay now we're going to have he's going to have to retreat as he only has like three jaggers four jaggers now and all of a sudden things are really looking bad here for my partner and so here i am i'm still in a good formation here securing this position to of course uh, give me the advantage hiding some dragonflies around there to scout of course i don't want any seraphim flanking me or anything of the sort Okay, Camille is run running out of energy. Serafima around there, very good timing. Activated the passive with the Seraphim, which is very good as well. Okay. Uh huh, uh huh. Okay. Things are not really looking good for Error 404 here. However, on my end, the only thing that is not looking good here on my end is the server connection, which is very, very bad. I kept lagging. Okay, so that Seraphim managed to somewhat. You know, like, pass through my uh, army here by sneaking from the side. And yeah, he's gonna go head straight towards my partner's base. And my partner, Error 404, is in big trouble. Just now that Leviathan, or yeah, that Leviathan and Solaris are so low on health. However, you got like three shields around here. Four shields around here. One has been destroyed. Solaris will be destroyed. Very good riddance, I have to say. And now I'm going to have to try and chase this Seraphim away as of course it might actually deal some huge chunk of damage out of my partner's base by in destroying those factories and so on. Okay now. Oh no, this is not looking so good now for my partner. However, um, those Zeus are not microed properly just to look at it. They're always firing at the same, you know, at the same um, location and it's not really looking good. Okay, so we managed to drive this army away. Okay, now, ooh, Poseidon around there. Oh, and then the two Typhoons actually got rid of my Wasp. I'm going to have to retreat. Now, my partner all of a sudden gained the upper hand here. And now going to attack 
Um, yeah, he's now going to attack Cap Mix is a small chunk of army that's been left over with a ton of Jaggers around here. Thanks to two vehicle factories. Okay, Lug Imboy. Okay, so I'm transitioning into an Albatross if you can see around here since I'm expecting this guy to have level 5 HQ as well as Cap Mixin. Okay, that Poseidon will obviously be destroyed as it's not micro properly. Scouts here made by uh, KZT. Just look at the amount of mammoths that I got right here. And uh, yeah. Okay, here goes the scout with the dragonfly. Let's see how this turns out. Ooh, plenty of Zeus. <laughs> okay, now. Alright, so I'm going to have to somewhat, you know, like, upgrade again those, um, those ABA factories. Got like level 5 HQ. And here goes the engagement. Uh, here goes the engagement, man. Here goes, here goes. Okay, that service was taking the full brunt of the damage. Oh, disgusting damage around there. All right, well, that's an exchange for that amount of damage that he dealt to my mammoths with the uh, his Seraphim or Solaris being destroyed. Now, of course, the porcupines are so super smart. Going Rambo, and he still have plenty of units around here. Thank you so much, Lag, for giving me the opportunity to feel your wrath by having that circle thingy going on. Yes, guys, at this point, I was so lagging that I absolutely forgot to do anything at this point, man. And that Seraphim just lounges forward without any care in the world and is just being targeted by my mole turrets. And yes, just like that, the tides have turned instantly. Thanks to the lag, Seraphim has been destroyed. Um, partner doing good around here with lack of porcupines. Seraphim harassing him, and here goes the uh, Leviathan. Boom. Okay. Okay, the acid strike was a bit late, not gonna lie. But yeah, it is what it is. Better than nothing. And I only have like a handful of units around here all of a sudden and he still has plenty of Zeus. Okay, I'm gonna have to retreat. I'm gonna have to retreat. Majority of my stuff are mammoths and I only have like no jaguars around here. Just mammoths. Oh damn. <laughs> Things are so not looking good. And he get like plenty of Zeus, but although it's badly bruised up. And now this, just heroes again. Seraphim, Solaris, driving an old army back. Okay, and here we go. Seraphima trying to attack that Leviathan. Okay, three chameleons activated at the same time as my partner here. And, uh, yep. Man, this is, this battle is insane. Very insane. Okay, nuclear. Boom! Okay, did not really get a uh, huge chunk of damage out of that nuclear. But the uh, Solaris skill did not, he also did not really got rid of good targets around there. Meanwhile, on my end, I'm still trying to somewhat scout here with the Hawk that I will manage to produce. And, uh, yep, I saw that he has plenty of Typhoons. And so it's time for me to go for mm, uh, a little bit of Dragonfly just to act as a meat bag. And then the rest will go to land army composition since I baited KZT into going for a massive chunk of typhoons. Alright, so here goes. He's trying to push um, Arrow 404 back. Capmix is going to have to retreat as I think most of his units are out of energy or HP. Mole here. Wasp. I got all heroes available here for me and I'm just waiting for that juicy attack. Recovery boost for the Leviathan. Okay, fast forward a bit. Okay, <clears throat> again Seraphim trying to cause some damage here, however there's only like three porcupines, four porcupines here from Era 404, which is again absolutely ain't enough against a Seraphim. Okay, I'll go recall one of my, uh, five of my dragonflies, and uh, yeah. Okay, again Seraphim just lounging casually here. Okay, that's bad micro for the Seraphim, very very bad micro. Okay, and here we go. All right, and let's see now what's gonna happen. Um, Cap Mixon is actually in a bad uh, formation here, as the Cap or uh, Cap Mixon is actually in a very good formation, and my partner isn't. But oh, disgusting damage! All right, almost killed that entire fleet or army. Okay, here goes again. Arrow 404, Camellia's running out of energy. 
Okay, and here we go, man, on my end. Here we go. <laughs> Plenty of Zeus against Jaguars, Mammoths, Dragonfly, Leviathan, and the uh, Wasp. Mole as well. Mole turret's been deployed. Boom! Solid hit right there with the acid burst. Let's see how this turns out. So my partner is also engaging cap mixing at the same time. That Solaris is so low on health. And uh, he he doesn't have any Zeus here. Just no, no Zeus, just the hero and typhoons. Meanwhile, KZT here with a huge chunk of Zeus. Ah, oh, this is gonna be hard. My wasp has been destroyed. His Solaris has evaporated thanks to my mammoths and the uh, gun towers. Here we go now. My Leviathan is still standing strong here because of the meat bag of dragonflies that caught all the anti air missiles. And here goes. I'm gonna have to try and get rid as many as I can around here. Oh, it seems that I again managed to win this over with just holding it on my own. <clears throat> very, very uh, good exchange here. Okay. <clears throat> and so I'm gonna have to uh, launch an attack here. And he still have plenty of Zeus, although some of them are badly bruised up. But let's see how this turns out. Okay, I'm actually using a recovery boost to recover the HP of some of my units. There it goes. Mammoth sieging from the back. Okay. Shields has been destroyed. Okay. Mam Mole here with the turret. Okay. And those uh, typhoons are going to be forfeited and they're going to be destroyed. Meanwhile, um, Edor404 here launching an attack against uh, Cap Mixon. Oh, what a very good formation, I have to say. Managed to kill or destroy that entire army of KZTs as Zeus with just a few Jaguars, a ton of Mammoths, Mole, Porcupine, and uh, Dragonfly. A little bit of Dragonfly here. Now go. Oh, there's like stores here from from Cap Mixon. Okay, now that Seraphim has been destroyed. And there goes that. Okay. Again, Thor. Not really a solid bombing run. However, that Solaris is here. Oh, straight line wipeout erase. Okay, that mole has been destroyed. So it's just a Zeus shield in the Solaris at this point. Okay, scouting what they have now. Okay, still HQ4. This guy's rebuilding his army. Okay, and all of a sudden... With just one Zeus, two shield, um, one of which has been destroyed, and then this second one will also be destroyed, I guess. Uh, no, never mind. Oh, yes, it will be. Yep, all of a sudden, things are looking bad here for Era 404. And, wow, <laughs> did that Zeus just blast away that wasp? Okay, now those doors are coming in. They're going to have to destroy Oh, shoot! Disgusting damage around there. Three Thors managed to destroy that um, special vehicle factory. Meanwhile, I'm going to have to lay siege on <clears throat> KZT's base or army. Okay, solid hit. Boom. Not really a solid hit here for my uh, Leviathan nuke. Although, there is the acid strike. <clears throat> there you go. Okay, so I'm going to have to try and get rid of as many as I can. The shield, um, since they are not really good micro, I mean, they're in front of the Zeus. <laughs> Who does that? Okay. All right, now. That shield is so low on HP. It's been destroyed. The Seraphim now is here. I still have my class 7 Leviathan around here with zero anti-air upgrade or five anti-air upgrade at this point of time. Okay, mole turrets here, trying to zone out that Solaris. Okay, and then mole turrets actually helped out in destroying that Seraphine. Okay, and so again, using a common, common production boost to speed up the process of albatross production as well as every unit that I have right here. And the lag in boy, as usual, I am lagging so bad. My newly produced units are just there. Okay, my Leviathan is so low in HP, and oh, Thor bombing run! Oh man, destroyed all of my Jaguars. 
So I only have like the mole mammoths and the, the Leviathan around here. Now, let's see how this goes. My mammoths are actually focused on that Leviathan. If you guys are noticing. Yep. Okay, I'm gonna have to retreat here. My mole's uh, passive has been uh, exhausted. Seraphima from Cap Mixon. Active skill of the Solaris. Uh, no, active skill of the Seraphim activated. Okay now, so I'm gonna have to move away here as fast as I can. There's only that one Solaris, three Zeus here. And I'm oh, barely, I barely have anything here. And then the lag kicks in. The mammoths were out of control. However, they still managed to destroy that Solaris. Oh my god. <laughs> what an insane guy. And here goes. We're gonna have to try and get rid of that, um, <clears throat> that shield of KZT. There you go. Nicely done. Okay. I'm gonna have to retreat here for a moment. Reform my army. <clears throat> Seraphim passive here. Uh, activated on the, uh, wasp. Okay. So my Leviathan here, I believe, will be destroyed 100%. Okay, oh, it will be destroyed. Okay. Yeah. Okay, my partner told me to use my albatross against this uh, side. However, at this point, you know, I was busy doing micro on my stuff. That my mammoths are actually being used to destroy that X facility. And then, of course, the mole will also drill here. So it doesn't really matter how, I mean, if I lose all this army that I got around here. As long as I can destroy that X facility would be perfect oh bombing run solid bombing run and then of course i'm going to have to retreat at this point i'll leave them all right there as a meat bag to buy my army some time to retreat here goes mammoth sieged and uh, are going to fire at that um vehicle factory albatross scouted the uh, capmixon's base okay army around here as well and so again I'm going to have to destroy that vehicle factory and I'm going to have to call it quits. Okay, Chameleon. I have to run away. Okay. Albatross going to have to try and bomb those uh, airfields. Boom! Destroyed Fort Source along with the airfield. <clears throat> and damaging that Avia factory. Okay now. And so again, another three Albatross here from my end. And I got like a good healthy amount of units around here. And the uh, Error 404 has just now um, reconstructed his base that's been being bombed by those Thors. Okay, here goes. Let's see now. Okay, bombing the airfield once again. And now he's gonna go in attack. Okay, acid strike, acid strike, come on. Okay, those Thors are now headed toward, straight towards his base before... Oh no, that's not a really good bombing run here. Okay, so I'm still re well reproducing the armies that I lost. And here goes now Cap Mixon's gonna go at it here with that badly bruised up Sol Solaris. Shield has been destroyed. Oh, that's not a very good wasp target. But yeah, very bad micro on that Solaris. Maybe they're lagging, I don't know. Okay now, Super uh, Seraphim active ability and it's gonna be a clash from here on. Why is that service not jumping? I don't know. And uh, yeah, it's not really looking good, man. Not really looking good. Oh no, 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 no. You're so outnumbered, uh, Cap Mixon. You need to retreat. You need to retreat. Oh, here goes the Leviathan nuclear pre prepping it up. Launch. Boom. Solid hit. And again, Albatross right here to bomb, um, bomb Cat Mixon, not giving him enough time to get those Thors back up. Uh, I mean, the Thor count back up, as I don't want Thors bombing my airfields or factories or my partner's factories or whatever. Okay, they want me to destroy, or my partner want me to destroy that X facility. However, I think the gr the the more the threat here is more of the Thors than that of the uh, heroes, but here we go. Destroying that airfield in an Avia factory. This army is basically junk now. Doesn't really have anything around it or anything of the sort. So yeah, I mean, Cap Mixon's lost his stores. 
and I also dominate KZT around here. Error 404 doing very good when it comes to zoning out cap mixing. Okay, so we fast forward a bit. <clears throat> All right, so oh, and that's Alaris. Oh man, that's without a shield. All right, so yeah, I mean that's gonna be all for today's uh, video. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and if you did, again make sure to subscribe, smash the like button, ring the bell icon to be notified of any content coming from my channel. Also check out my previous videos as they contain tips, tricks that can help you in a battle. Likewise, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Have yourself a great day and good luck with your battles. Okay, here we go. Albatross here from my end. Huge bombing run. Kabloo! Victory. Bye now.